gives them a satisfaction they couldn't get any other way. Hey folks, welcome back to 3 Pound Fishing. On this episode, let me tell you, we put a ton of fish in the boat. Not to mention a 2.4, a 2.0, and several 1.8s. Folks, this is the best evening on the water so far this winter, and we do it in short order. A sunset cruise as we're calling it, the moon phase is in our favor, and that's what we're doing tonight. We're catching fish, plain and simple, following schools, throwing up against the shoreline, and fishing drop-offs. Thanks for joining me. Please do me a favor and subscribe. Let's have some fun, folks. This is crappie fishing, and we love it. Here we go. Get ready for a fantastic episode from Three Pound Fishing. Thanks to these great sponsors. So me and Marcus are out here on a sunset evening. It's a sunset cruise. <laughs> Chase it down, crappie. Hopefully we'll be casting by the end of the night, but we're starting off with uh, early evening, 320. We've got about an hour and a half to fish. Got a couple good ones in the boat. See what we can do. I'm fishing with the Ozark Rod 10 Foot Pro Series Gray, 10% off. If you use the code three pound. All right, so there's definitely a little bit more to this evening than just the fact that it's a sunset cruise and we do really well tonight. It's a little bit more about the moon phase and going back to that story. Now, the moon is without a doubt in its full brightness right now. This is probably the worst time to fish in terms of days. But what I've always been told is that if you go, if it's going to be a bad moon, it's a bad day for fishing, you want to go late in the day. And that's what we did on this particular day. We went out there at 320 and these fish started to feed. And let me tell you, we had talked to some fishermen on the lake and they were not having success all day. But, I, but I'm telling you right now, come about three o'clock, these fish start to feed again, and that's exactly what we experienced on this trip. So I believe in the moon phase a lot and a lot more. Um, and if it's a bad day for fishing, I'm telling you, experience the late night, the later bite. I think it gets a lot better. These fish are starting to feed up as the dark darkness ascends upon us. So. That's a good fish right there. I can, this is a good fish. This is a good fish. I hope it's a crap. So I hope it is. That's a big crop. Yes, sir. That could be it. That could, that's a two pounder. Bam. Nice. Oh my God. <laughs> That is a beautiful fish. That's that's a thick fish. That is huge. Wow. I was like, I knew that sucker was a big fish. Spot lost or no? Yeah. Wow. 2.40. That is a hog. What's he, what's he measure? 240. This is how fat this fish is. That's 14 and a half inches. <laughs> 14 and a half inches. That's how thick that guy is. Right there. Wow. Take pictures with that guy. Eggs on that thing. Good God. Right there. Good fish. Good fish here. There's another one. Double that. <laughs> Show what you got, Mark. Oh yeah, good fish. Look at that. I will. 
We're having fun out here tonight, man. It's beautiful. <laughs> Freaking awesome. I'm fishing with that uh, tickle fry with a 32nd ounce redhead. I'm getting it down there quick with a quarter ounce split, split shot. Six pound line, high viz all day long, folks. Prototype rod, these will be coming out in middle of April. The new color scheme. What's up? Huh? So this is the first folks at the Illinois Department of Natural Resources stop us on the on the lake and we took 15 20 minutes with this guy to show him all of our credentials. That would mean driver's license, uh, your fishing license, obviously your fire extinguisher, your floating devices, your whistle or horn. Um, everything that we needed, we had. So it felt really good to be in compliance. We always are in compliance. We believe in safe waters. And um, it was quite the experience though, because you know, you, you take for granted, you know you have your fishing license and you gotta find it. So having all that in one spot on your boat certainly makes that experience easy. And uh, they definitely patrol the Southern Illinois waters and I appreciate them for doing it. Um, but great experience. Um, Took about 15 minutes out of our fishing experience, but regardless, it was a good experience. I don't believe in filming those type of things, so I definitely, I turned off my camera, to be quite honest with you, and I just didn't think that was right, so. Nice. Oh my God. <laughs> damn, oh, dude. damn. Oh, nice. baby. <laughs> <laughs> up right where you left off <laughs> so let me get you out of the sun folks that's another big time fish we just got start, stopped by the uh, DNR and got a uh, had all the questions uh, license all that good stuff and uh, it was nice to be compliant it was really nice to be compliant. Nothing to worry about. That's another big slab. One point eight. Wow. Yeah. And uh, anyway, we appreciate them doing that and keeping everything safe. It's a uh, it's kind of my first experience with that. So being able to find your license and all that stuff was nice. <laughs> the heart rate goes, I won't say the heart rate goes up, but I definitely wonder if you can find your shit in time. Marcus the opportunity to get ahead of the game, catch a fish. Because when I throw this guy out at him, it's all over. All over. Marcus. 
good opportunity to get ahead. Oh my gosh. You can't even you can't even mess with that. That is straight out there 40 feet. Let that sucker drop. Fish are out there about six, eight feet down. I'm letting it drop right now. And then I'm gonna start the slow roll back. That's all it is. Marcus got ahead of the game. Give me a black nose here. Baby, that's a good fish. <laughs> you know what? You know what? <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> yeah. Woo, baby. That's a monster. Oh, man. <laughs> that is exciting stuff. That is awesome stuff. <laughs> you going to wow. put that on the scale? Yes, sir. We've been putting them on. All the big dogs have been going on the scale. There you go, it's on you. Three pound, <laughs> one ounce. <laughs> Two pounds, nine ounces. <laughs> it 2.09. 2.09, that's amazing. Awesome, dude. That's yeah. freaking fantastic. Special fish right there. That is special. Marcus, be careful. He's gonna make love to it right there. <laughs> That's awesome. That's why you fish. Oh, dude, there's just a ton of fish here. Ton of fish. Ton of fish. Another nice fish. There it is. Good fish, man. Again, these fish are about 40 feet out there on the ridge. You let that thing sink. Drawback. You hope it's a big one. The other people stand. <laughs> there it is. Man. Ooh, this could be a good fish. He's a good fighter. Yeah, I've had a lot of good fighters today. That guy got that sucker all the way down there. 12 inch fish right there. They're all getting thrown back tonight. Take some pictures with those big fish. Can't wait. This tickle fry is just crushing it. Can you even reel that? Yeah.
there's one right there. The marks don't look big. This is a good fish right here. The marks don't look like there's a ton out there, but they are. They're just all sitting on the bottom. That's a 12, 11 and a halfer. You don't get the satisfaction maybe of picking one out of a brush pile. Although sometimes you can see it happen. You do, you can watch it happen. Um, there they are right there. Tons of them right over here on the side. There it is right there. <laughs> Sweet spot. You can actually saw that fish coming out of the, the active captain right there. You saw it coming. And that's a good fish right there. That's a 12. We're just keeping two pounders tonight <laughs> for pictures. We got a 1.8, I think, though. Hey, it's a great day. Go ahead, you show them. Show, show the fine folks at home with two two pounders 2.4, 2.09. Bam, another good one in here, too. Check this one out. That's a heck of a night. We were out here for what, hour and a half max? That's right. Big time. They're going back in, folks. Somebody else to enjoy the catch. Turn in the three pounders, what we want them to do right there. Bam. Good night on the water. Beautiful, too. That sun, uh, that sunset is awesome. Good day. <laughs>